basement is always really, really creepy. This is a tunnel? Oh, dude. Basement to sixth floor. What's up you guys my name is Chad welcome back to another nighttime hospital adventure hopefully haunted tonight we are checking out a recently closed down hospital so there's still some power on in here crazy crazy place a lot of history here as with any hospital there is lots of death that always happens here um, there's stories that about a lady who hung herself here uh, there's a ghost girl that's supposed to be in here um, so we're going to check this place out tonight and see what happens. Um, I do have Levy with me tonight. So we are back again. We are back. Go check him out. Yeah. Chasing the darkness. Paranormal. Now, he was saying about the, the lady and the little girl. I was reading an article about this place too. About like seven murders happened here. And fights. Always breaking a fight. And if you look at the article, it's insane when they talk about this place. So they are, it, it is haunted. I've been to the school here uh, a few times. And you know, you hear a few things in there. But when we go to the other side of the side bar, I'm telling you, this place is creepy. And you guys want to be here for a treat, hopefully. <laughs> so let's see. Let's see what happens. All right. Hell yeah, guys. So there's a lot of crazy history here. Um, we're going to check this place out tonight. We're going to explore, investigate. We're going to do everything we always do. If you haven't already, give the video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Go check out Levy's channel, Chasing the Darkness Paranormal. I will leave his link down below in the description. What we are going to do tonight is we are going to never be scared. We are going to explore the hell out of this place. This is going to be insane. Let's get on it. Let's go. back into this little kind of patient area here and we just heard two knocking sounds in here and like a metal thing okay so i was sitting just uh, i came here earlier with my friend my vanessa and we thought that window was an exit so um while we were getting out of the window i was hearing like boom boom and then i was hearing like boom boom and then like somebody was like literally dragging or something like like that and then right now, I was explaining him, and we literally heard something right now. What are you talking about? Can you make those two knocking sounds again? Do you want us here? That's weird. So guys, right when we walked in this room before we started filming, we heard like, it was like something like that over here. I wonder what's going on this one. We got that animal or something in there. No, that's wood. There's nothing under there. These are wood. I don't know. That was creepy though. My camera keep my camera off over there. You just heard like a noise here. It's a weird room. <laughs> Medical supplies. Yeah, this is an extremely weird room here. Look they got these like oh look at this syringes, needles, injectables, venny puncture. Oh, it's locked. Can you make something happen with us? Or give us a loud bang, we'll leave. Don't be 
you're shy. You're just curious. See when I turn my back, that's what happens. Do you not like us being in here? Just give us a loud bang and we'll leave. We promise. Dude, that, I don't know. That's weird. It's a weird area. But it's funny, when I was explaining to him what was happening, it happened. Yeah, already, something else. already, guys, we're hearing like weird sounds. I haven't caught anything on camera, but we've been hearing sounds all over this place. Not just because it's an abandoned building, but we've been hearing like knocking, tapping sounds. Definitely creepy so far. And it's weird that it's not like too beat up. It's not like really decrepit. It's it's more like recent, so it's still in pretty decent shape. But we're gonna explore around this place. All right, guys, we are making our way into another part of the building. We're trying to be real quiet. Oh, what the hell? What the, there is uh, security. I don't know if they come into the building, but they definitely make their rounds. So, we're trying to find different areas of the hospital to explore. Oh, wow, dude, check it out. We're going into the auditorium. Whoa, dude, this is nuts. Look at that. Yo, this is sick, and it's still in pretty good condition, man. Seats are in good condition. This is crazy. Still got the lights up top. Wow. You can't even tell how big those lights are, but they're pretty big, dude. Like, they look small like that, but in my vision, they're, like, big. That's sick right there. Really? Yeah. Yo, that's crazy. Do you want to set up like a REM pod over there and see if yeah. somebody comes along? Oh yeah, we're gonna go to the psych ward. Yeah. But yeah, we'll come back. This is sick, you guys. Absolutely sick. So we're gonna come back and check out this auditorium in a little bit on the way out. Super duper duper cool. Yo, you guys, check out this insane gym, dude. There's basketball hoops, they're broken. Look at all this stuff, dude. Little seating area. Dude, this is nuts. This is sick, dude. Yeah, man, there's all kinds of, uh, there's all kinds of like gym equipment, like workout equipment and stuff over here. Yo, this is crazy, dude. Oh, somebody wrote boobs on the wall. Good job, good job. But yeah, look at, I mean, we're on the classroom side right now. Or the uh, school side, I mean. So you'll see like the auditorium, there was some classrooms we passed through. So there's a school side and then there's a hospital side. So we're trying to we're trying to uh, work our way to the hospital side so we can investigate and see what's going on over there. But right now, this is crazy, dude. Totally awesome. Oh, look, they got a freaking uh, a banner. 
Let's go check the banner out. Champions up here. Division champions. Holy cow. Look at that. Innovative Basketball Association back-to-back -back champions 2001-2002. Wow, that's crazy, dude. And obviously they destroyed the uh, gym here. <laughs> but this is totally nuts. Oh, yeah, dude. Let's check this out back here. There's like a little workout room over here. Pretty crazy. All this workout equipment. Lifting weights and whatnot. Look at that. It's freaking cool as hell. This actually isn't even that bad a shape, this thing. Probably still very usable. Yeah. Wow. Everything left behind in here, man. Holy cow. the loudest freaking footstep I've ever heard in my life, dude, in that room. Who's back there? Are you guys doing explorers? I'm going to tell you one thing. We're playing for stupid here, okay? If you don't want to see it, just let us know. Are you homeless? Do you need help? You want water? You want food? You heard that, right? You heard it? Dude, it was it was like this, dude. Whoa, it was like this. So I went in on the left, checked out this little like um, gym machine thing, like weightlifting machine. Then I went to go walk in that room and I heard this. Like like somebody stepping on glass, dude. me that was me hello be careful what you do here though there's no one in here there's no one in here dude it was right here it was right here dude yo no because I would have seen him I would have seen him. Yeah, and you would have heard until the little floors are pretty enough, right? Dude, dude, tell me you guys heard that. Right when I was walking in here, it was like st somebody stepping on it. It was not me. It was not me. And look, there's literally like no glass on the floor either. Oh, over here there is. Look, right here on the ground, there's like no glass. And over there is a ton of glass. But it, was, it wasn't over there, it was over here. Yo, that was insane. That was insane, dude. That's crazy. The spirits here that want to communicate with us? If you want to communicate with us, please do. Why did you turn it off? <laughs> Is it the cold, maybe? Yo, that was... Here. Dude, that... Look at how creepy this hallway is. One guy kept saying I say it's creepy too much. But I ain't never gonna stop saying creepy. <laughs> never, ever. Well, everything, everything that I do is creepy, dude. Yeah. You know, yeah. everywhere I am, it's literally creepy. I'll say it a thousand times. It's freaking creepy. Right, so my part, my dude, power. right here. I can't even believe. Oh my God, dude. That, that bugged me out. That bugged me out. Have you been down there? I don't need this. I guess we're going down here then. Holy crap, dude. Oh, that's the outside. Hello? Look how tight this is. It's like for a kid. Such a small door, dude. Yeah, man. Yeah, it's weird to go into an abandoned place and not see destroyed toilets and sinks. All this stuff is like still intact right here. 
This is crazy, dude. Yo, I can't believe that. I can't believe that just happened, dude. That's crazy. Bro. That was so crazy. I'm like, this place, is, it gives you, I'm gonna say, it gives you a creepy vibe. Here. It does, dude. It really does. You know, imagine doing shit by yourself. Oh my God. Yeah, if you wanna go, <laughs> we could go on different floors. I mean that dude that was insane. I can't I just psych war I definitely go by myself. Yeah. I, I can't believe that man. Guys, check it out. Here's the swimming pool, dude. We found the swimming pool. We're still on the uh, children's side of things. The school side. We're gonna be heading into the psych ward pretty soon. To see how crazy that is over there. Hopefully it should be fun. And hopefully some things happen to us. Look at this, man. This is wild. Somebody put a basketball hoop in here. But yeah, this room is gigantic too, man. It's like a gigantic pool room. So, God, this is unbelievable, man. And it's crazy how newer it looks. A lot of the times you, you guys see me in these old decrepit buildings and stuff. Not this time, man. This place is crazy. Still in pretty decent shape. A lot of broken glass. But, man. Check out this. I guess this was a TV. This must have been a TV. Oh, almost fell in the damn pool. <laughs> but yeah, this is a TV right here, I think. Or something. Oh, no, there's no wires or nothing in it. It had to be a TV. I don't even know. Yeah, I'm not sure. But either way, it looks like it could have been a TV or a light of some sort, maybe. Maybe a light. It's crazy that that would be sitting there. And then the old locker rooms here. Right next to the pool area. It's crazy that there's no, uh, none of those pool uh, chairs. <laughs> none of them are left behind. We're working our way into the psych ward. Yeah. Be, Levy says that uh, he's not sure if the door has an alarm on it. So, we're gonna go check this out and see what the door looks like. It's a creepy hallway too, man. Look at this. Wow. All right, here we go. I don't know if that's a sensor or not. <clears throat> but I don't know. I mean, the fact that they wrote it huh? with a marker yeah. kind of makes me think it was Urban Explorers because they would have put a sign there. Yeah. If it was like hospital workers, you know? Oops. <laughs> they would have put a legit sign, I think. Yeah, I did that other sign too. You know? <laughs> I don't know, dude. I, I mean, I don't know. Do you want sound? Do they have like siren alarms? I mean, it's possible they have silent alarms, but I don't know, dude. I mean, I've never been here before. That's just the door creaking. Kind of 
nerve-wracking because we don't know if there's silent alarms. So it doesn't seem like there is. The only reason why I think because it's like it just this side. I don't know. I mean, the door opens. And I think that because it's a marker, it was probably just some kids. It would have been more professional for them to put a sign there. Exactly. You know? And plus, it would have been freaking locked. way more locked. It would have been amazing. It would have been probably Fully bolted and chained. Exactly. You know? Oh, yeah. So you would have sound if, if, if you got to put it down the handle. Yeah, I think just, just some kids wrote that. If it is, we some lucky bastards. <laughs> we might have to run. All right, guys. We have made it through to the other side. There is power in here. This is totally insane that we don't hear any alarms. It didn't look like any of the cameras were working. So we are on the other side and there's power going on in here. It's real eerie and quiet. Oh, I can't open this. These are all locked. Oh, look. Here we go, old hospital files, dude. Holy crap. Executive Department Office of General Services. Holy crap, dude. There's all kinds of crazy stuff. I don't want to show too much of it because I don't want to give it away. But this place is crazy, dude. so wild that there's power on in here still part of it part of it is an active hospital still which is on the other side and uh, right now we are on the non-active part but it still has power oh look at this dude look at this it's a freaking old ass record player I think. Look at that. That's freaking cool as hell, man. Caliphone or whatever it's called. Look at that, man. Wow, that's insane. But yeah, look, there's first aid kit. Oh, there's some power. <laughs> Yo, this is nuts. Lockers left behind. Dude, this is totally nuts. an old filing room this is crazy imagine if somebody just jumped out of nowhere you could tell people have been in here because uh, there's graffiti on the wall so people have come in here but maybe during the day I don't know but this place is absolutely crazy dude I can't believe we're walking around in here right now this is I, uh, this, this blows my mind. This blows my mind, dude. And there was a bunch of murders that happened in here. I mean, I don't know, dude. What's this, dude? I'm trying to find Levy right now. Yo! No, dude. No. I was looking for you. It came from over there. came from over there. That definitely was not me. I walked in. I think that back thing maybe had like a uh, Wi-Fi thing. I don't know, dude. I don't know. All right, guys, so but they, they probably would have already been on it, man. Yeah. You know? But I wonder what's another way from them to get here. The ones we don't even use, they push that shit out. I don't know, dude. But that door's not like me. Yeah, I heard it was over there. All right, guys, we've made our way into the area that was the children's psych ward. And uh, Levy says this is the area where the lady hung herself. So Whoa. Oh, dude, there's a freaking... Look at that. That's really creepy, actually. Look at that, dude. Electrode board. I wonder if this was like a 
I was going to say a patient room maybe, but I don't know. I see filing cabinets and stuff in here, so I'm not really sure, but this is weird. What are these things? What the heck was this used for? Wow, there's a lot of really weird stuff left behind in here. I'm gonna turn on my old handy dandy Obulus device and see if I can speak to the woman who hung herself in here. <gasps> where? Yeah, where? Where did you cross over? Yo. Yo, listen. So. Huh? So listen, uh, I was talking about how, um, I was gonna turn the obelisk on yeah. and look for the lady that hung herself. Okay. So as soon as I turned it on, it said cross over. I'm looking for the female that hung herself. It's weird that it says above too. Like above what? Above the tub? Is that where you hung yourself? Above the tub? Yes? No? You know what's really weird? My last couple of videos when I was in Mary McClellan Hospital and I would point my camera at the obelisk, it would stop hair. Is that how you hung yourself? So listen, if you are here and you hung yourself I want you to say the word hung or hang or noose complete. We're not sure what we're seeing and hearing in here. We're hearing a lot of weird noises. Levy said he saw somebody standing. This is a really weird looking cart. Look at that. Wow. That's crazy right there. Yeah. Oh, dude. Psych on call. That's nuts, dude. Housekeeping. Poison control. Safe floor. Ninth floor. Where's the Floor five. Eighth and ninth floor should go up. I don't know. I don't know. happen here. I don't know. Let's go up. <laughs> like, I, I feel like I've been doing this for so long. And sometimes I hear voices, like not in my head, but I hear like from the background. And most of the time, I've never been wrong because I catch it in my voice recorder. Well, I doubt there's anyone walking around outside. It's snowing, it's yeah. cold. Yeah. It's dark. Yeah. If that thing's not working, I think we'll do it because nobody's gonna come near here. I don't think anyone's coming near here, dude. This is a perfect time to do something. Here. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. No one's coming near here. <laughs> Why do you think I do stuff at night, bro? Oh, Whoa. Right when you said that, it said poltergeist. Really? See, it still says it. Can you make something move? Poltergeist. Oh, shit. And look, find it on the stairs. Oh, let's go up. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's freezing over here. All right, I'm going to shut this off real quick. Oh, why is that? Oh, are the windows are open? Is that why I hear air?
the basement? Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> okay. Spirits hide in the attic or the basement. Yep. In this case, the basement. The basement is always yeah. really, really creepy. This is a tunnel? Oh, dude. Stairways, basement. Basement to sixth floor.